Taka Cat started in Takapuna on Auckland's North Shore in 2007. Now under new management, Taka Cat is expanding into larger vessels, of which the Taka Cat Predators T640P is the largest so far. Manufactured in South Africa for Taka Cat by Stingray Boats, the Predator T640P is a catamaran rib with a rugged GRP hull and good quality hyperlong tubes. It's a narrow, stepped tunnel design with large volume wrapped round tubes divided into six separate compartments for safety. The Predator T640P is carried on a single axle custom built Hoskins trailer. With the tubes fully inflated, it's a wide boat on the trailer, and with seemingly acres of deck space and large diameter tubes, it looks much bigger than its 644 meter length. Nonetheless, it weighs a relatively modest 750 kgs on the trailer, so it's easy enough to tow. Apart from its size, the feature most people commented upon was the four and a half side seats, one each side of the boat. They have reversible backrests which allow the passengers to sit facing inwards or outwards. The seating layout was chosen to leave plenty of clear deck space down the vessel's centre line for easy access to the low transom, which is great for scuba diving or commercial applications such as ferrying resort guests. Of course, the seating can be arranged in more conventional four and a half rows, and several different console and helm seat options are available, as is a hardtop bimini. Somewhat unusually, fuel is carried in tote tanks inside the seat bins, which are big enough for two 26 litre tote tanks per side, or one tank aside plus some dry storage. The 640P's deck is self draining via ball scuppers, and the Teak Look PVC foam flooring is soft and secure underfoot. One of the Predator T640P's strengths is the amount of deck space it offers. It's a beamy boat anyway but the tubes are mostly outboard, so they hardly encroach on the boat's interior. I was initially somewhat sceptical a pair of 60 horsepower outboards would provide sufficient performance for such a big boat, but I was pleasantly surprised. The twin 60 horsepower Suzuki's are towards the lower end of the recommended power range, but they do a more than adequate job. The Predator cruised along at 4000 RPM, making a very comfortable 18 knots, or 23 knots at 5,000 RPM. You could expect a top speed approaching 30 knots once the engines are completely run in. The vessel step tunnel hull is clearly an efficient design that delivers speed and economy, along with an excellent ride. Unlike most catamarans, this boat doesn't lean outwards and turns. It doesn't really heel inwards like a mono hull either, but instead turns very flat, which is where the straddle set comes in handy. Just brush your legs and grip with your thighs to combat the G-forces. We're aboard the Taka Cat Predator 640 uh, P. T. It's T, and that's for target or P. 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 P for Predator. For Predator, right. Yes. So that's that's the model name. Yes. Um, this is one of this is a nearly seven metre boat. I understand it, Paul. Uh, yes. So this is a six point four metre. Um, we go up to a seven and a half metre right. in the catamaran configuration, uh, and we actually start at uh, with a four point six metre. So four point six, a five point five. Uh, the 6.4 and then the 7.5. Now this is quite an unusual configuration, at least for, for New Zealanders. I mean we've got a, a rib, but it's also a catamaran. Yes. And I guess that sets them apart from pretty much anything else that I know of in the market. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I guess that's a unique point of difference really. Um, it's a super stable platform, um, very efficient hull design. We're running two 60 horsepower Suzuki four strokes, uh, very quiet. Uh, you'd, you know, they don't need a lot of power to get them up on the right. plane. Now, the manufacturer has been um, building the style of uh, hull for uh, over 30 years now, right. and um, they are preferred by the um, South African Navy um, because of their stability and, uh, and handling. Right. All right, and um, they're available now here in, in New yes, Zealand? Yes, we've, yep. uh, we've got two in stock. Um, and of course um, we can custom build so we can change the configurations around to suit uh, but yes we have two uh, available they're sitting on Hosking trailers right cool well thank you Paul it's no been, problem it's been uh, a very enjoyable thank you. couple of hours the Predator T640P travels very comfortably the hull smoothing out the chop and generally delivering a dry ride during our review the sea built quite a bit but the Predator seemed to come alive in the chop I got the impression it would handle much rougher conditions with ease. The Taka Cat Predator T640P rib's biggest strength is its capable, stable and rugged stepped tunnel catamaran hull. 
As presented here with a few equipment upgrades, this rib, while still a basic package, seems to offer fair value, especially in terms of performance and handling. And depending on the budget, customers can pick and mix console and setting layouts, engines, equipment specifications and colours across the range. John Applesome from Boating New Zealand. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you'd like to see more of these videos, please subscribe to our channel.